What's up guys and welcome to a brand new Battlelands Royale video. So in today's video we are going to be playing Battlelands on my PC using this awesome free Android emulator called Nox Player. So there is a link in the description if you want to try it out for yourself go into that link it's a free download. I personally recommend it from what I've seen so far it's pretty much the best looking mobile game emulator on the market right now. So yeah the plan for this video is to try and get some high kill wins in Battlelands using Nox Player. Now I am using my controller but you can also use a keyboard and mouse as well and uh, could it possibly make me an even better player? Let's find out guys. But first please show support guys, I'm thinking of starting daily videos on my channel so if you would like to see that go and smash the like button and then let's see if we can try and hit 1500 likes on this video for a new skin giveaway this week. So here it is, this is Nox Player. You can see it's running really, really smooth actually. It's uh, it's really cool to be able to see Battlelands on such a big screen. It really enhances the experience of the game. Obviously playing mobile games, you're playing it on a tiny screen. But with the bigger screen, hopefully it will actually make us better at aiming. So uh, we'll have to find that out guys. So if you would like to try Nox Player out yourself to see how good you can get in Battlelands, there is a link in the description of this video. It's a free download and uh, once you've tried it out, I want you to come back here to this video and drop a comment and let me know what you think of it. And I'd love to see some of your gameplay as well. And if you have any awesome gameplay clips, you can actually send them to gotgang4 at gmail.com. So obviously one awesome thing about Nox Player is the keyboard configuration and the possibility to use external controllers. So to set up Nox Player with a PS4 controller, just connect it to your PC, click the icon at the top left of the screen, and you literally just drag each analog stick to the left and to the right hand side of the screen. You can see there it's really, really simple to set up. And if you do have any trouble setting it up yourself, come back to this video and drop me a comment and I'll do my best to help you out. But yeah, the gameplay is pretty smooth. But uh, so far it is actually going better than I expected. Now uh, one thing I did want to mention actually, there is so many other games you can play. This is an Android emulator. So if you play Brawl Stars or Clash Royale, PUBG or Fortnite, whatever you play on your phone, you can use Nox Player to play all of your favourite games. And I'd love to know from you guys how some of your other games play within Nox Player itself. But uh, one awesome thing about Nox Player is that you can actually run three different Android versions. So I personally don't understand the benefits of that, as I'm not personally an Android user. But it's there if you want to do it. Okay, so we could be onto something here, guys. I'm pretty sure from what I've played so far, having a bigger screen, a bigger area of play, you know, visually sitting in front of a computer monitor, you just spot things a little bit quicker and your aiming is definitely more precise. So I've literally just started using this guys and I'm already finding myself playing better so I'm definitely going to be using Nox Player more often. Maybe with a little tweak in the settings you could probably set up like a godlike aim. I'm not trying to get like a crazy kill record here, I'm just trying to get used to the emulator. Another really awesome thing about Nox Player is that it has the ability to record your gameplay as well. So I know a lot of you have your own YouTube channels and you like to share gameplay, share the clips. And obviously myself as a content creator, this is literally so handy to be able to actually record your gameplay. But no, this has got me thinking actually. For one of my next videos, I'm thinking of doing a high kill tutorial in Battlelands, where I'll basically do a step by step instructional video on how to get high kill wins. So, is that something you think you'd like to see? If it is, go and hit the like button, drop a comment, and uh, let me know what you think on that, guys. Maybe we can even use Nox Player, and uh, maybe we can even use this for live streams as well. And uh, I am actually thinking of doing my first live stream when we hit 350,000 subscribers. So, uh, go and hit the subscribe button, and make sure you hit that bell icon, and uh, let's see how fast we can get to 350k subs anyway guys if you're still undecided on whether to try out nox player or not we are now going to go ham and really push the boat out to see if we can get some high kill wins using nox player so remember there is a link in the description of this video and also on the pinned comment in the comment section. It's a free download, go and try out Nox Player and when you have I want you to come back here to this video and drop a comment and let me know what you thought of this emulator. I want to hear your experiences and remember if you do want to join my clan we're now taking new members so go and drop a comment on this video if you would like to join the GOT clan and don't forget to hit the like button if you'd like to see a new skin giveaway this week. Alright guys, let's try and get some high kill wins using Nox Player. Let's do this. 